How to create 3D Instagram profile picture using Canva, very easy. Hi guys, welcome back to another tutorial with me. I hope you all are doing great. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can create a 3D profile for your Instagram, and it's gonna be so easy, and you're not gonna regret clicking on this video. So let's get right into it. So obviously, first of all, you're gonna to need to load canva.com. Once you load in canva.com, you're gonna go and create a design. You're gonna go on custom size, once you go on custom size, you're gonna put in either 720x720 or 1080x1080. Preferably 1080x1080 because yeah, that's the Instagram post ratio. So now you're gonna click on create new design. Uh, once you click on that, it's gonna load you up right into the blank canvas. Here's a 1080 by 1080 blank canvas. Now we're gonna go on elements. Once we're in elements, we're gonna write in frame. Once we write in frame, here's gonna be different types of frames. There's one specific frame that we need to click on. And that is, it's gonna be, yeah, there it is. It's this frame with the big borders and the circle in the middle. So we're just gonna increase the size and we're gonna put it right in the middle like that. And once we do that, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna upload the image we want. So we're gonna upload it. Now, once the image we want is uploaded, we're gonna just click on that, bring it here. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go on transparency, decrease its transparency a bit, and we're gonna bring it, for example, we want it to look huge and popping out of the image we have. So we're just gonna do our best as much as we can. And once we do that, here we go. I want it to look like that at least. So once I do that, as you can see, it went behind it. So we don't want that. Right now, we want it to look like this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go and I'm gonna boost the transparency back for this. I boosted the transparency back. Now, what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go to a new tab and go on remove.bg. And once you do that, you're gonna take the picture that you uploaded in Canva and you're gonna come down and upload it over here. And once you upload it over here, you're gonna remove the background now, if you have Canva Pro, you can just remove the background from here, but obviously I do not have Canva Pro, so I'll just go here. Look at that. The background has been removed, and uh, you can download it if you want to download it normally. You can do that, or you can download it HD. So I'll just download it normally because you know, that doesn't really matter for me right now. So I'm going to go and I'm going to upload the background image. Well, now I'm going to set it again, and uh, once it's set it up, if I could just, there we go. Now, the image I want is like too small. So I'm gonna bring this in and I'm just gonna cover it up with this. We're just gonna do that. We don't wanna take it in there. We just wanna block this. It's gonna try to get in there. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna set it around with your arrow keys. And uh, just make sure it's in the perfect position that you want it to be in. So there we go. And just put it down a bit and look at that. Here we go there. So that seems like the perfect uh, 3D image to me. And this is just a, a raw image. You can make much better images than this. As you can see, it is 3D. It's popping out of the banner. Now you can change the color of uh, the picture or you can change the color of the border if you want to. You can decrease it in size. You can crop it as you can see. As if I don't want the crumbs, I can just crop it like that. Obviously this looks a bit off, but doesn't matter. You can increase and decrease the size like that. And we're just going to do this so it looks back to normal. There we go. And uh, yeah, that's basically about it. And uh, then you're just going to go on share and you're going to go on download. You're going to go on PNG and then you're just going to download it and upload it to your Instagram. That's how simple it is. So thank you. I hope this video was helpful to you and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.